So we're going to look here at the fader jumps to Q-step option. This is something that was added in software version 1762 onwards. The concept of this fader jumps to Q-step is that using our fader, rather than having the fader controlling dimmer for our playback, we can change the fader function so with the fader at zero, you'd be at the first queue in your stack and the fader at full would be the last queue in your stack. So let's show you how that works and how you enable that. Quickly let's build up a queue stack with a few queues in it. So if I grab my spots, select some palettes and just copy those to a playback to make a quick color bump queue stack. And now I'm going to merge some intensity into that so we can see what's going on. So put some intensity in the programmer, shift record, merge, select our queue stack and merge that dimmer into this queue stack. And now if I double click my select button, change this to queue timing. So I've now got a simple queue stack with colors. So we can see as I bump through the queue stack there with my go button, we can see each of the colors in the stack there. So at the moment the fader is just controlling the dimmer on my playback as you normally expect. If we triple tap the select button of your playback, under the queue stack options window now, in the fader tab you've got this option at the bottom there, fader jumps to queue step. If I turn that on and set fader controls HDP, so fader controlling the dimmer, the default, switch that off. If I now open up the queue stack window again, double clicking my select button, you can see as I bring the fader down it jumps to the queues in the stack. So at zero, we're at the first queue, at full, we're at the last queue, and anything in between there. I will also respect any fade times as well. So if I go and put, say, a three second fade on all of those queues, and then use this option as well, you can see it applies that fade time that I've selected on each one of my queues to go to that color as well. So if I jump up from there, uh, Q4 up to full, you can see there it respects that three second fade to do that. Okay, so that's the fader jumps to Q-step option in your Q-stack window.